Hey, Austin. I want to welcome the people that's watching us to a brand new edition of Let's See What the Doctor Ordered. Where did that package come from, Austin? Sykesville, Maryland. What? Sykesville. Sykesville, Maryland? I ain't, I, I've never received anything from there, have I? Be careful how you're holding that knife, man. Man, why don't you sit that? Why don't you sit that package down so you don't cut yourself, son? That's that one. I don't like the way that package is. The way that one's looking, the way it's set up, man. Move my move, move my soldering thing equipment back, man. So you know, yeah, you don't want to damage anything. Cool. You look, look on the bottom of that. Look how that look. At, you can see a seam there. Yeah. Right. Man, you don't want to cut yourself with that knife. Watch your fingers. In other words, keep your fingers out of the way. Keep your body out of the way, man. Uh, about that exercise. That's probably some tubes in there, man. Let's see what the doctor ordered. Yeah, RCA 1287. So it should be another RCA 1287. What is it? Mm -hmm. okay. 1287. I ordered a bunch of 1287s. Yep. Off of the bay. Off of the E of the bay. E of bay. Anyway. Out of way over there, but I have see I I have a, I have tube testers so I can immediately test these tubes and determine if they're good or not. And those that are not good, I can return them and get my money back. All right, so those are all RCAs. That's what I was saying, man. I, that's I try to purchase. Um, when I can, some vintage RCAs, because I like the sound of the RCAs better than any of the other tubes that are being used in Leslie's. So, even though I don't like to sell them, they just they they sound better. They're just a better tube than these new tubes that they're making now. That RCA is just a better quality 12AU7. So, on that audio side of um, of amplifiers, you know, especially if you got a you got a, a 147, you only use one tube. And if I only had one tube, I'd use that RCA. Now you can use the uh, the old fashioned tail Funkin, old old fashioned Muller, old fat, you know, the vintage tail Funkins and those Bugle Bugle Boys. Those are great tubes as well. But uh, these new edition. Uh, so you have to be careful about them. I, I I played one new one tonight, and that thing sounded a little muddy. And it changed it out, pulled it out, put in a put in a vintage RCA, changed the sound of the uh, of the amplifier. So um, that's why I ordered some vintage RCA amplifier uh, tubes from for my for my amplifiers. All right, until the next uh, video, Dr. Camp here, along with my grandson, Austin over there, AJ. What are we going to say, Austin? Peace out. Just like he said it.